Excuse me, dearie. Behold, mortal! You have entered the domain of the dead! To where would you like us to send your restless soul? Perhaps it shall reside in the jar of endless torment! Or, for a nominal fee, mayhaps into the wooden closet of hell to be lowered into the very maw of Hades himself? Let me just check my husband's will. <clears throat> Mrs. Doeward, while I do appreciate your, um, passion for performance, I'm afraid this is one egregious step too far. Come on, Halloween is in a few weeks. Right, but this is a funeral home! You're fired, Penny! Well, you can't fire me. I quit! You can't quit, Mrs. Stowood. I just fired you. My quitting is retroactive, boss. How's that taste? Hey, Penny! Come on, boyfriend. Future Penny can easily find a new job tomorrow. But for now, present Penny is in a bad mood and wants to cheer herself up. And food, movies, and smooches are gonna be perfect! Well, I never. My husband put in his will that I really did want to be catapulted into the jaws of Hades. Sorry I won't be able to help you, ma'am. That's okay, dearie. Hey, can you drive? All right, rest in peace, past Penny, who had a job that didn't let her have fun. Next stop, anything but that. So you're keeping the demon horns? I like them. Yep, best part of the uniform, and I had to pencil it into the dress code. And don't worry about the job. You'll probably fall into a new one within the week. Ideally, it'll be the one that lets me keep the spooky Halloween theme. Yeah. Hey, the fog's getting pretty thick. Are you okay? Fine. Not hurt at all, actually. That was really lucky. Good. Take that, Death! <sighs> We'd better get back before the fog gets even thicker. We can take care of the car later. Let's cut across the graveyard. Really? We almost died once today. What are you, afraid of ghosts? Penny, if a real ghost appeared, you would probably be a little afraid. Nah, i just say, ah, holy crap, a ghost! And then be totally cool. Classic me. Mausoleum. Let's check it out. I don't know. As you can see, it's perfectly safe. Ah! Uh! What 
where am I? What happened? Ah! Holy crap! A ghost! Welcome to the land of the dead. <laughs> Cute. No, see, there must be a mistake because I am an alive human. Ah, denial. The first stage. You get through it. After that, there's anger and bargaining, both fun, and then depression, honestly a drag, but then acceptance. Okay, good luck on your journey. I'm not in denial! I deny it! Welcome to the party! Sorry, not dead. Also, not in denial. Hey there, newbie! Don't forget to book the spa early if you want a place. It fills up with ghosts fast. I'm not a go- Wait, there's a spa? Well, there's a cesspool of tears. Can't miss it. It's always screaming. Somehow. That's not a spa. Right, and you're not a ghost. Excuse me, sir. You haven't fixed my problem yet, and I... My apologies, Lady Elder Doe. As I'm sure you know, staffing is an issue here, and we're all doing our best under very difficult circumstances. Now, if you've got a complaint, Form XG-532-7 can be filled out, and... Yes, I've... Hey, sorry to interrupt, uh, whatever this is, but I think there's a small chance I may have died, um, somehow, and... Wait, what are you doing here? Demons aren't allowed on this level. Oh, <laughs> I'm not a demon. I'm actually just... Oh my gosh, the temp I ordered. Finally! The temp? The temp! Finally, after 1,825,911,238 hours without a break, I get a vacation! Oh, the moon, here I come! The... the moon? You've never been? It's the one place near Earth where nobody has ever died. No ghosts, no demanding restless spirits, just a peaceful wasteland of rest, relaxation, and rock collecting us over 300,000 kilometers from the nearest soul. <sighs> Can't wait. Uh, You'll need this scythe. Okay. And this cloak. Company policy. But... And I'm sure Lady Elderdo can provide any training you need. She clearly believes she knows what's best for everyone. Why, you... you insolent... Well, goodbye. Death is going on vacation. They didn't give you any training at the temp office, did they? Uh, no, because Typical. I'm not... Just typical. All right, I'll give you the basics. See those ghost critters? I need you to catch them. Throw your scythe up there, then use its switcheroo powers to teleport yourself right to it. <laughs> Wait, this thing teleports? No way, no way! That's awesome! I can definitely be the temp lady. Right, you're not as completely useless as I'd feared. Uh, thanks. It's time to possess a human. Possess? Like actual crawl on the ceiling while vomiting possession? That's rarely necessary. See that chap? Once you have enough ghost critters, try possessing him.
Insane! I'm actually inside this guy's head! And there's all these things I can pull! What does this do? Living fear! The boat man is here! And he is not big in the Man, I'm the best at naming ice cream flavors. I can name 50 of them, no problem. Including two secret flavors from the government. What are the secret government flavors? <laughs> yeah, right! Like I'd tell a voice in my head that. Nice try, telepathic ice cream cone. Huh, seems like you learn all sorts of useful things while mind reading. And less useful. Now, what happens if I push here? Ah! <laughs> this is fun! It's alive! I shouldn't have mixed pistachio and lemon. They clash. Stop it! Why do my teeth need to be clean? Never would have been on here! <laughs> Alright, that's enough, Tim. I'm pretty sure I got murdered. I remember getting married and then BAM! Corpse City. Oh. I can't move on until my killer is brought to justice. I'm freezing my bum off, so I'm in some place cold. And it smells like, I want to say, TV dinners? Go find my killer temp. I have a feeling you should check my bridegroom's mansion. It's up in the forest. You got to cross the lake. That way. I have a feeling you should check my... Oh, so that's how come nobody can escape death. There's a magic map on his scythe. It all makes sense. Notice that weird ghost hand up there? I'm pretty sure I saw it grab a monster. Thanks for the tip. Uh, need any hand with that fire on your head, or...? <laughs> no, I'm fine, thanks. Ahoy! I see old secret mistress has caught your eye. Huh? Why, the boat black lover. Named her myself, I did. After me mistress, who, incidentally, I absolutely did not want my wife to know about. You know, I would have guessed building a boat that you effectively named the SS I'm having an affair. I'd have tipped her off. Oi, <laughs> that it did. Oh, me wife murdered me in a jealous rage. Nicked me before I could finish painting my boat. All the planks need now are a fresh coat of paint and I could finally rest me weary bones in peace. Trying, but it'll take something with a little more chutzpah to get inside his head, dearie. Have you seen any of those rare ghost critters around? I know I've seen some up by the forest, but I can't quite remember where. the 
best ice cream I've ever eaten. Ah! Everyone, my legs have been possessed by a vengeful ice cream cone. I'd like to make Everyone a citizen's arrest on that, that ice cream. A joke, but, but that I'm would be really unethical. This time. So instead, I'll just follow you around. It's okay. Thank <laughs> you.